Hey everybody, this is Steve from GamersNexus.net and we are testing a power supply today in this basic PC hardware guide. We're going to use a paper clip, a green wire, and a black wire to test the power supply and make sure it turns on. Uh, some power supplies will need to be put under load, but I'll get to that in a second. So first, make sure your power supply is completely unplugged just for safety purposes. There's really not much risk of, of getting shocked here, but for safety purposes I would advise you to unplug it and completely turn off everything, turn off the switch in the back. Find your green plug and your or green cable, excuse me, and your black cable, which is ground. And we are going to connect the green cable and the black cable via paperclip to jump them together. And once they're connected, which I am doing right now, you see I have them connected in the 24 pin or 20 plus 4 pin connector rather. And once those are together, you can pretty easily just plug the power supply in like normally. Uh, of course. There are there's only one way to plug it in, which takes me two or three tries at least. So we're gonna plug that in, put that cable aside, and then simply flip the switch, and you'll see the fan spins up. Hopefully the YouTube quality isn't too bad, but the you should see the fan spinning right now. And then I'll go ahead and disable it, and bring that a little bit closer so you can see it better. Now what I want to say is some power supplies won't respond to this technique. I think the OCZ power supply specifically won't because they need to be put under load otherwise they just won't even turn on uh, so if that is the case with yours I have a trick coming up that will uh, will basically plug in some fans and put it under a tiny bit of load just a couple watts that way we can be sure that it's working this is not a extremely definitive test in terms of checking to see if the the right wattage is being supplied or to make sure the power supply is you know completely functional it is a good test though just to narrow down your options if you if you have some kind of failure along the line if your computer is not starting up this will help you tell you know hey is it my power supply is it my motherboard what's going on here so this is a great always a great start when you're troubleshooting your PC and it's very easy so now you can see I'm grabbing the uh, Molex 4 pin to 3 pin fan adapter I'm gonna plug that into the fan that I pulled out of my CPU heatsink yesterday which is in the previous video and it is a very fast fan. So I plug those in, and then we're just going to skip ahead here while I fumble through for the right wire. And we connect the Molex connectors, and then we'll just do the same test again, except this time with the fan. And as I said, OCZ normally is the one that causes trouble, some others do as well. You may need a couple fans, you might even want to plug a hard drive in there. It's, it's just plug it into the power supply and then turn it on. It doesn't need to be in a system or anything like that just needs to spin up so here we go I'm reconnecting the green and the black wire as you can see and it has to be green and black um, as I said there's minimal risk of shock because these power supplies are designed specifically not to cause those problems but you want to be safe then unplug everything and uh, and do it just like I did there and sometimes capacitors can store a charge so you might want to use pliers if you want to be ultra safe but again you should be pretty in the clear here so we see that it turns on perfectly with the fan fan spins up and this is actually the first time I tested this fan so it was a good way for me to see how fast and how loud is this fan in comparison to my replacement fan and the answer is it is a very fast and it is actually really quiet uh, I think my new one's a little bit a little bit slower and uh, and about the same noise level but I explained that in the last video so there you have it that's how you test a power supply hopefully that helped someone out and uh, as always like this video if it helped you please subscribe to our channel I can't emphasize that enough subscribing really helps us make more videos a lot of you have subscribed from the last couple videos so I appreciate that keep subscribing keep liking comment on videos we will help you out wherever possible I'll see you guys next time peace